I think people should come to Kaiser for their maternity care because I think we provide the best maternity care, hands down. When it comes to prenatal care, I think first and foremost, patients are looking for someone that they connect with, that they want to share such an intimate time with. And then past that, they're looking for something that's convenient, that meets them where they're at, and that's comprehensive and individualized. What is key about Kaiser is you can actually pick what type of provider you want whether you want to be seen by a nurse practitioner or a nurse midwife or an obstetrician or a physician assistant. You can make that initial selection and then develop a relationship with that person. Everybody's really familiar with you and, and kind and warm and you know, it just seems like they know you. And they're just excited too. Like that's, what, that's kind of what surprised me a lot of like, you do this every day, but you're just so excited for everybody. And, um, that was really nice to have, just that energy. We also provide three different hospitals that patients can deliver at in different geographic regions to make it a little bit more convenient for them. And then we provide choice in the way that they can communicate with us. Not only will we see patients in person, but we can also make video visits so they can actually see their provider while talking to them you know, through the computer, or they can do telephone visits or in-person visits as well. Anytime I sent questions or anything like that, they were really quick to respond. So I didn't have to call and necessarily wait on hold or set another appointment. I could get quick communication. Dr. Seidel told me to look up the website, um, the, the KP maternity website, which was awesome because then you get to read everything and see how big he is and, um, and that really helped out a lot too. Because we have our computerized medical record and we are a system that has primary care and specialists as well as mental health providers, dietitians, we can help a woman optimize her health before she even makes that choice of when she first wants to get pregnant. So I think Kaiser has a great model. Really, it's a team approach. So we have our OBs, we have our NICU docs, we have any subspecialist that we would need to involve for either mom or baby, and then us, the, the perinatologists. And because we're one big system, it's really easy to work as a team. I mean, I can send a patient's chart with one click to any of those subspecialists and get feedback, whether it's an inpatient consultation I need or just some kind of curbside recommendations. The whole concept of two heads are better than one. Sometimes in uh, high-risk obstetrics, maybe that's five or six heads are better than one. Things like anxiety and depression are often things that patients don't want to admit to or talk about, and providers are often scared to talk about. But here at Kaiser, we feel that Attention to the entire patient, which includes their mental well-being, is really important. I might not even know that I have postpartum or I don't know that I'm depressed or not doing well. And so then with them checking in on me, I might have found out, you know, I needed help or something. I didn't, luckily, but it was nice to have them checking in on me to make sure that I didn't need further care. Our Kaiser C-section rates are lower than Colorado and national levels. One of the reasons why I think we're able to keep our C-section rates so low is that we are in the hospital 24-7. There are always two Kaiser physicians in the hospital focusing on our pregnant and delivering patients. When moms go home from the hospital, a nurse practitioner or a midwife comes to their home within a day or so um, of discharge. And it's basically, I always say it's like an office visit at your home. We come with a scale and all the tools we would need to take care of you know, mom and baby in the home. I thought the nurse who visited the home was, was very helpful and it was very informal. And then later she, could t she texted with me, she checked in with me a, a another day to see how a certain issue we had talked about was progressing. And and so that felt too like somebody was concerned and they weren't just gonna give me the information and disappear, there was follow up. All the nurse practitioners and midwives that do the home visits are um, certified lactation consultants or internationally board certified lactation consultants. And so collectively we have years and years of experience to help moms and babies be successful at breastfeeding. I struggled a lot with breastfeeding in the very beginning um, to the point where I was just like, 
crying for like three days. When she came two days later to the house, which was amazing, I didn't even have to go leave my house to go and have the you know two-day visit. Um, and you know, she just kind of sat me down and was like, this is what, how you do it, this is what you need to do. And by the time she left, I was definitely not an expert, but I felt far more capable. Um, and ever since then, it's just gotten easier and easier. In Colorado at Kaiser, um, at six months of age, 50% of our babies are still exclusively breastfed, whereas in the state of Colorado, that rate is only 25%. So our moms really benefit from the expertise we have at home. This is not a job that you just show up and do your work and go home. This is something where we really invest our hearts in, in every day. Um, what I hope for my patients is that they feel like I am their sister. That is the level of care that they feel from us, and and that's why we do what we do. Say hi, Sylvia Grace. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that's the best thing that came out, actually. <laughs> I loved the day, the delivery day, and it was just, everything about that day, it was just wonderful, and I would, probably wouldn't have changed anything about it at all. I would actually not even do it again. <laughs>